XX Hello Glow Fan, Vince here and welcome back to my YouTube channel. As always, make sure you like, comment, subscribe and hit that little notification bell so that you are always updated. All the products used in this video will be listed down below and if you are buying any, don't forget to tag me on Instagram at XXOOVince with the hashtag Vince made me buy this. You can follow me on all my social media accounts, everything will be up here and linked down below. Also, be a part of the GlowFam Facebook group chat community by clicking on the link down below. In today's video, GlowFam, gagawa tayo ng prom look. Kung lalaki ka, gusto mong magmukhang maayos sa prom nyo, gusto mong magmukhang presentable, gusto mong mapansin ka ng mga girls, gusto mong maging star of the night, huwag ka na mag -alala. I got you. Kung babae ka naman, and nanghihinayang kang magbayad ng makeup artist para sa prom mo at meron ka mga nakatambak na makeup dyan, huwag ka nang mag-alala. Sobrang dali lang nito, and sigurado kung kayang-kaya mo talaga to. So again, I'll be doing prom looks for guys and for girls, dahil malapit na nga yung mga JS prom natin dyan. And one more thing, Glow Fam, before we even start, we will be testing out this palette from Squad Cosmetics. This is called the Neutral Squad Eyeshadow Palette, and meron siyang 9 shades, and sobra-sobrang excited na ako gamitin tong palette ato for today's look. So what are you waiting for? Grab a drink, sit back, and relax, and without further ado, Let's glow. Now let's dive in, Glow Fam. Sisimula muna natin yung tutorial sa brows or sa kilay natin. For that, I'll be using the Minisaw 3-in-1 Angled Eyebrow Pencil in the shade gray. So first, Glow Fam, using the pencil side, i-outline ko muna yung brows ko. Now that we're done outlining the brows, meron pa mga gaps yung kilay natin. So we need to fill that in and I'm using the sponge side ng eyebrow pencil natin. So slowly fill in the gaps ng kilay natin. Don't worry, Glow Fam, kung lumalaman lampas kayo kasi it's okay kasi lilinisin naman natin siya using a concealer later. Now that one brow is filled in, kunin nyo yung spoolie then I brush off nyo lang yung brow to make sure that the product is well distributed. As you can see Glow Fam, medyo smoked out pa or flushed out yung edges ng kilay natin. So now dito papasok yung importance ng pagka-carve ng kilay. For that I'm using the L'Oreal Paris Infallible Full Wear Concealer in the shade Beige. So lalagyan ko lang yung ilalim ng eyes ko sa taas and sa gilid. And dito na rin sa gitna. Now using a flat brush, ikakarb lang natin yung brows. Now using my fingers, Glow Fam, I'm just smudging out the edges para well distributed din yung concealer. Now that one brow is all done, gagawin ko lang yung other brow off camera and we'll be back. And now that both brows are all done, Glow Fam, gusto ko lang sabihin na if you are a guy and hindi ka masyadong sanay magkilay, you can get a mascara, either black or yung clear mascara. I suggest na kung makapala yung kilay mo, yung clear yung gamitin mo. Kung medyo manipis, gamit ka ng black mascara. Lagyan mo lang ng konting, konting, konting mascara yung kilay mo and I think you're good to go. Basta yung tip ko lang sa'yo, wag mong bibigatan yung kamay mo pag naglalagay ka ng mascara sa kilay para hindi sobrang intense and nakaka-intimidate yung kilay mo. Moving on, magpa-prime na tayo ng face glow fam but then before that, bago pa ako magsimula mag-vlog, I already washed my face using the Lana PH Activated Charcoal Soap. Sobrang favorite ko yun. Minsan ginagamit ko rin yung age defying soap nila. Minsan ginagamit ko rin yung brightening soap nila. So, I highly recommend those products. Use code VINCE5 for 5% off upon checkout. After that, I also wash my face using the Lana PH Soothe and Hydrate Gentle Cleanser. Yung combo na yun, hinding, 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 hindi mo wawala sa skincare routine ko. And I love that. So now, let's proceed by using the Lana PH DNA Repair Elixir. Kung sudyante ka and wala ka pang proper skincare products, you can skip this step. Pero for me, sobrang importante to. Kasi siya Siyempre, pag nasa prom ka, medyo ilang oras din yun. And gusto natin well-prepped yung skin natin under all the makeup na ilalagay natin sa mukha natin for that event. For added moisture, I'm using the Lana PH 100% Pure Argan Oil. Hindi lang to basta nagmo-moisturize ng face. Nakakapag-heal din siya ng mga hyperpigmentation. And that's why sobrang gusto ko tong product na to. So, slightly massage yung Argan Oil sa face natin later on. Iko-control natin yung oil by using another product. Speaking of oil control glow, Fam, I'm using the Quick Effects No Shine Mattifier. Sobrang okay tong primer na to, Glow Fam. Lalo na sa mga estudyante. Kung wala pa kayong masyadong budget. Yung ginagamit ko yung nasa tube. Pero available din siya sa mga pouch. So, kung nagtitipid ka, I suggest na bilhin mo muna yung pouch. 
And kung meron ka ng medyo extra budget, then you can buy the tube. Tulad nga na sabi ko kanina, it controls the oil dun sa mukha. Yes, naglagay tayo ng argan oil. So, hindi lalabas na sobrang dry yung mukha natin. Medyo radiant lang. Yung meron pa rin tayong konting-konting glow. For foundation today, I'm using two. Sobrang magkaiba yung formula nito. Pero I just love the combination ng formula nito, lalo na sa mga event like this. So, we will start with the Maybelline New York Superstay 24-hour full coverage foundation in the shade 310 or sun beige. We will do two pumps nitong foundation na to. This foundation glow fam is a bit matte. I mean, hindi siya a bit matte. Matte talaga siya. And we don't want to look super matte pagdating sa mga event nito kasi parang ang dull nung dating. So, we want it to look as radiant as possible. So, we will mix this with the L'Oreal Paris Infallible 24-hour fresh wear foundation in the shade golden beige. So, we will just do one pump of the L'Oreal Infallible. Imimix ko lang yung foundation together para mag-even out yung formula niya. If you are a guy and meron kang foundation, that's good. But if you don't have one, and if you don't want to put too much makeup on your face, I suggest that you wear a BB cream. Kasi for guys naman, it's not really important na maglagay ng foundation. All you need is to even out your skin tone. And a BB cream could do that. Hindi siya sobrang full coverage, pero magiging maganda yung finish ng face nyo. Now, let's apply the foundation to the face. I'm just using a flat brush kasi gusto ko super even talaga yung paglalagay ng foundation before we even blend it out. So, we will start with this, Glow Fam. Hindi muna tayo maglalagay ng sobrang dami kasi we don't want to look super cakey. Dun event na yun. So, using my Glam Skin Manila sponge, let's bounce. Actually, itong 2020, pag mas natural yung itsura ng skin mo, mas maganda tingnan. Hindi na ganun kauso kasi yung super full coverage din. So, yun lang yung gusto natin ma-achieve. Gusto natin maging radiant lang yung itsura ng face natin. Medyo glowy tayo. Simple lang yung dating, pero maganda. Now that we are done with foundation, it's time to bring back some highlight on the face. So, for concealer, I'm using the L'Oreal Paris Infallible Full Wear Concealer in the shade Beige. We're not gonna base on concealer, so sobrang konti lang ilalagay natin. One, two. Of course, we're putting a little bit dun sa high points ng face natin. Now, let's bounce. Kung ikaw yung type ng student na medyo may mga pimples ka, you can use your concealer para spot correct or itago yung mga blemishes na nakikita pa dun sa face mo. Pero kung medyo okay ka naman, clear yung skin mo, gagamitin mo lang yung concealer to highlight yung mga high points ng face mo. Ayoko masyadong nagsasalita kapag nagbe-blend ako ng concealer sa ilalim ng mata kasi parang the more I talk or the more I move mas lalong nagkikrease yung concealer and we don't want that. So pag nagbe-blend ka ng concealer, tingin lang ng derecho. Now that we are done with concealer, it's time to set the face. So for that, I'm using the Vice Cosmetics Dual Finish Foundation in the shade Morena. For the guys, if you have pressed powder or pressed foundation, that's good. You can use that. Actually, what I'm using is a pressed foundation. Pero kung wala kayong pressed foundation, guys, pwede kayong gumamit ng baby powder to set your face. Kasi para sa mga guys, syempre hindi naman sila masyadong aware sa makeup. Kapag yung BB cream mo hindi mo sinet, at pag pinawisan ka sa prom, ang lalagkit at maglalagkit yung mukha mo. Now, I'm just using a fluffy brush from BTLA to set the rest of the face. For the girls, if you're looking for a pressed foundation or pressed powder, I highly recommend itong Vice Cosmetics Dual Finish Foundation nila. I think this is around 200 plus. I'll put the prices down below. Pero sobra-sobrang ganda ng foundation na to. And yung shade range niya is good for mga Pinay. Karamihin ng Pinay mga morena and makakover ng Vice Cosmetics Dual Finish Foundation kung ano mang skin tone mo. I swear. Now we will bake and for that I'm using the Cody Airspun Loose Face Powder in the shade Translucent with extra coverage. Now for students na hindi pa alam yung purpose ng baking. Unang purpose ng baking is to bring back the highlight dun sa face natin kasi nga yung ginamit nating pressed foundation is only one shade or one tone. And yung shade ng powder na ginagamit ko is a bit light for me. Nilalagay ko siya under the eyes para bumalik yung highlight. Another thing if you bake, you are making sure na hindi gagalaw yung base na nilagay mo dun sa mukha mo. Then we'll brush off lang natin yung bake using a fluffy brush. I want to complete the look for the guys first so we will finish the rest of the face. Let's move on to contour. I'm using the Detail Makeover Contour and Blush Palette. So for the guys na ngayon lang nanonood ng makeup tutorial, ang importansya ng contour is to bring back yung shadows ng face mo since parang one color na nga lang yung face mo, ibabalik natin yung mga shadows. We don't want a super intense contour, so we are dipping into the bronzer shade. Oh my god, nag-hit pa 
na ako. And a little bit of the contour shade. So first, ilalagay muna siya natin dito sa may cheekbone para mag-warm up yung complexion natin. Then, extend mo siya hanggang sa may forehead. Dito sa temples, hanggang sa forehead. Now that we are done with both cheeks, guys, listen up. Wag na wag nyong kakalimutan yung jawline nyo. Siyempre, gusto nyo maging foggy, gusto nyo sharp yung jawline nyo para mas ma-attract yung mga girls sa inyo. Kung meron naman kayong double chin, guys, maganda rin tong medyo pang daya. Ngayon na napalabas mo na yung jawline mo, i-drag down mo lang siya ng konti para wala ka namang harsh line sa ilalim ng leg mo or sa leg mo. Ngayon, syempre, kailangan natin ng ilong. So, kukunin natin yung same shades na yon. Pag naglalagay ka ng nose line, magsimula ka dito sa may, sa may loob, just right below nung inner brow mo. Tapos, drag it down. Once nagawa mo na yun, kung medyo malaki yung dulo ng ilong mo, i-close mo lang siyang ganito. And done, meron ka ng ilong. Now, for girls, if you wanted to intensify yung contour nyo, it's up to you. Pero, wag naman yung sobrang contour na contour na mukha kang Kim Kardashian. Hindi magiging natural yung itsura ng makeup natin. And, hindi naman yun yung masyado natin ina-achieve for this look. So, let's move on to the blush. I'm using the Vice Cosmetics Auto Blush in the shade title. Kung wala kayong masyadong budget pang bili ng mga blush or ng contour, maganda yung contour ng Vice Cosmetics din, yung Auto Contour in the shade for sure. And for me, para sa mga moreno or morena, maganda tong blush na title kasi meron siyang konting-konting orange undertone. So, hindi ko muna dinadrag yung brush ko dito sa cheeks ko. Konting-konti lang muna, dinadab ko lang muna siya para ma-achieve ko yung gusto kong flushed look. For the boys, importante din na maglagay kayo ng blush on kasi ayaw natin magmukhang patay yung kulay natin. Gusto natin mukha tayong kinikilig. So yung blush on yung magbibigay sa inyo ng ganong klaseng illusion. Ako, I like putting blush on my nose para pantay yung pagkakilig mo. Alam mo yun? Hindi lang sa cheeks nagbablush sa nose din. Ayan, perfect. For the guys, we are almost done. Ito optional to for the guys pero nire-recommend ko pa rin siyang gawin. For highlighter, I'm using the EB Advanced Glow Out Highlighter in the shade Spotlight. If you guys wanted to achieve yung medyo flushed out na highlight, I suggest to use a big fan brush para hindi ganun ka-intense yung dating ng highlight nyo. So para sa mga first time nanonood ng tutorial, naglalagay tayo ng highlight sa mga high points ng face natin para pag tinamaan tayo ng ilaw sa prom, medyo nag-glow pa rin talaga tayo. Using a smaller brush, maglalagay din tayo sa tip ng nose natin, sa bridge ng nose natin, sa cupid's bow, and sa chin. Para sa mga guys, for your lashes, you can either use a black mascara or a clear mascara. It's up to you, pero just do a very, very light coat. Ayaw nyo naman maging super on fleek yung lashes nyo. Mas bongga pa yung lashes nyo dun sa girls. Mag ganun. So, super light coat lang ng mascara would be perfect. Now, to finish the look for the guys, I'm using a fixing spray. This is the Lux Organics Hydro Firming Mist. And magsispray lang tayo. Just to clarify guys, we are using a fixing spray para lahat ng powder na nilagay natin dun sa face natin is maging one shell with the skin. Para mas mukhang natural yung itsura nyo. And one more thing pala for the guys, dun sa lips nyo, pwede kayong gumamit ng lip tint. Tapos, ismudge nyo lang ng konti, okay na yun. Hindi naman kayo super required na mag lipstick kayo. Or kung gusto nyo magmukhang mas hydrated, maglagay kayo ng lip gloss, okay na rin yun. Pero kung medyo vain ka at gusto mo mag lipstick, humanap ka ng lipstick na MLBB or My Lips but better na shade and yun yung i-apply mo sa lips mo and that will be perfect. On this part, apparently my audio gave up on me. So now we will be using the Squad Cosmetics eyeshadow palette. We're dipping into that brown shade as you can see how much pigment, how much fallout there is dun sa eyeshadow palette na yun. Now we are trying to apply that on the upper part of our crease. And now we will be dipping into the ash gray color on this eyeshadow palette. As you can see, again, same formula, sobrang ma fall out. We will put that just right below our transition shade. Now we will be dipping into the pinkish peach color on this palette for a pop of color. And same formula din siya, powdery din yung palette, sobrang powdery niya. We will put that on the crease itself para magkaroon ng magandang shine and color. Now we are dipping into the dark brown shade on this palette. Apparently, hindi masyadong nagsashow up tong dark brown shade na to. I don't know what's happening on this palette. Here I am if you want to achieve a, a better look, a more pigmented look. I really recommend these two eyeshadow palettes. First is the EB Advanced Rich Eyeshadow Palette. And next is the Glam Skin Manila Skin Eyeshadow Palette you can see all the beautiful shades na meron yung mga palette na yun. Now this time, we will be putting 
putting on the shimmer shade and I really hope now it's not the same formula as the matte shades. Though the shimmer shade was a bit powdery, first I tried it with a flat brush. Um, it's a dry brush but then now I tried to wet the brush to get more pigment on the pan and yeah that's a lot better. But then I'm not that contented and I dipped my finger into the palette and I stamped that on my lids for a better payoff. So now let's finish off the Ice Glow Fam. For my wing, I'm using the Caroline Graphic Liner. Lagi ko tong ginagawa pag gumagawa ko ng wing para mas precise. Naglalagay ako ng tape. Maganda tong technique kapag hindi ka pa sanay mag-liner. Lalagyan mo lang ng tape yung dulo para mas precise yung liner mo. So now natapos na tayo maglagay ng wing glow fam. Binawi na lang natin sa wing kasi hindi naman sobrang bongga yung ginawa nating eye look dahil nga dun sa disappointing na eyeshadow palette na yon. I'm sure na pag gumamit kayo ng ibang palette yung mga na-recommend ko na iba, mas magiging intense yung color dito. Pero alam mo kung gusto mo, if you're going for like a sheer look, okay na rin tong gantong makeup lang. Pero syempre, prom yun. Gusto natin magpa-impress. But then, yun na nga. Let's move on. For mascara, I'm using the Maybelline New York, the Hyper Curl Waterproof Mascara. Let's do a generous coat ng mascara, especially sa girls. Kasi later on, once you clamp the lashes, kailangan natin ipagdikit yung lashes natin totoo, tsaka yung falsies natin. Now the mascara and lashes are on, let's do the tight line. So, for that, I'm using the EB Advance I Define Waterproof Matic Eyeliner in the shade Smoke. So, kailangan babawiin natin sa eyeliner yung I look na ginagawa natin. Make sure na i-connect nyo yung tight line nyo dun sa my wing area. Let's finish off the lower lash line. We are dipping into this brown shade. Chocolate brown shade siya. Let's put this shade, drag it across your lower lash line para meron tayong smoked out effect. Then let's dip into this medyo peachy shade. Just put that right on top of the deep brown chocolate shade. Take a smaller brush, go back to your highlighter. Maglalagay tayo ng highlight sa inner core Using a smaller brush, maglalagay din tayo dun sa inner lower lash line. Going back to the fluffy blending brush, we will put a highlight just right below our brow bone. And for your lips, you have the option to keep the gradient lip. Or pwede kayo mag full on lipstick. And papalitan ko yung lips ko. So I'm using the EB Advance Absolute Matte Lipstick in the shade Galore. This is my favorite shade. So now let's apply the lipstick. And now to finish off Glow Fam, let's do some spritz of the Lux Organics Rose Water Glow Mist. <sighs> This is a look all done, Glow Fam. Let me know your thoughts. Nagustuhan nyo ba to? Medyo mas natural glam to compared dun sa normal kong ginagawa. So, if you like this type of glam, sound off down below. Before I even finish this video, I'd like to give a couple of XXO shoutouts to a few members of the Glow Family. To start with, we have Aisa Benoit. Aisa is also a beauty guru. Same like me, medyo nagsistart pa lang din siya sa YouTube. And marami siya mga reviews and iba't ibang klaseng variety videos. So definitely check her out. Next shout out goes to Sachiko Miyashita. Same as Aiza, si Sachiko rin. Beauty guru din siya, startup YouTuber din siya like me. Marami rin siyang magagandang looks and magagandang reviews. So definitely check her out. The next shout out goes to Noveline Faye. Noveline Faye is also a startup YouTuber. So I'll also put her link on the description box down below. Para ma-follow nyo rin silang lahat. And the last shout out goes to Danny Star. Danny Star is a makeup artist, nagpo-post siya ng mga looks niya sa Facebook. So, kung gusto niyo makita yung Facebook account niya, I'll also put the link down below. That's it for today's video, guys. Thank you so much for watching. I love you guys so much. XXOO Glow Fam, and I'll see you on the next one.